all of my art heroes are landscape painters because I'm a landscape painter. And they all have places that they are just deeply passionate about that is the wellspring of who they are as artists. And for me, it's the, this kind of forest and it's Overton Park. I'm Martha Kelly. I'm an artist. I'm a printmaker and a painter and an urban sketcher here in Memphis. And I grew up here. This is where all of my art springs from. You know, this place formed me, this deciduous forest. This is where I walk every day and it's where I think about art. So even the art that isn't here, I'm thinking about it in this place. I probably paint here, like really sit down with a sketchbook, a couple of, like get all of the, the gear out a couple of times a week. I mean, this week, it depends on weather. You know, in the winter, it's less often. This week, it's been every day because it's glorious. And I'm thinking about prints that are forest prints right now. So sometimes I'm working at the river, sometimes I'm working on something completely different. I'm doing a whole bunch of printmaking in the studio and I just walk here. But my dog is older and slower than he used to be, and I always have kind of my smaller sketchbook, and I can do quick sketches with him, give him a little break, do a quick line sketch. I, I think I have vaulted early into, you know, the eccentric old Midtown lady who's out doing her thing. And very nicely, when you're home, they know who you are and what you're doing when you're sitting there with your feet in the gutter. And, <laughs> and they're like, oh, that's Martha, she's drawing, or I got her calendar last year or something, you know. It's nice, it's nice to, to see the same people, to see neighbors, to see friends, to know faces, to say hello, to have chats about the forest. There's a lot of artists and musicians who walk here and photographers. It's really nice to, to have the people who share this artistic place with you. I started painting actually on my family farm outside of Arlington. And it's a lot of the landscape that we are now losing to asphalt and subdivisions and parking lots. And, and Overton Park, as we all know, we have lost lots of it to asphalt and are continuing to lose parts of it to asphalt. And I always, I always really hope that my work will make people look at the beauty that's around them and appreciate it and see it as something worth preserving because you have to, especially with public lands and especially in the cities, you have to continually protect the public space that is supposed to be ours for generations from the politicians who see it as free land and the path of least resistance to building the things that they need. I, I've just done a forest sketchbook called Peas for Possum and at the back of the last page, I have a map of Overton Park that shows the green area and the asphalt, and it has a little history of how hard we have to fight to protect this place, generation after generation. One of my many trees I keep coming back to. <laughs>